in dealing with debt. Credit card debt is hitting a trillion dollars. We are here to end that. Matt Schultz from Lending Tree is back with another way to budget your money to get out of debt and control spending. We're here to talk about the envelope system. It's very popular, Matt. What can you tell us? The envelope system is basically what it sounds like. It's an old school, hands-on way to make sure that you aren't spending more than you have. It's literally putting cash into envelopes and maybe even writing down the goal um, associated with that money or the spending category associated with that money on that envelope. Again, it's an old school, kind of old fashioned way um, to, to handle things, but a lot of people like it because it really can be a good way to stay disciplined because once that money is out of that envelope, it's gone and you're done with spending on that, uh, on that category during that period. Are there any downsides to this system? What are the caveats? Yeah, the, the envelope system isn't necessarily for everyone. For one, it requires a lot of discipline because when that money is gone, it can be really easy just to say, oh, well, I still need to spend, so I'm going to break out my debit card or credit card and go ahead and spend anyway. So that's one negative. Another is simply that if that cash gets stolen, misplaced or whatever, it's not going to be able to be replaced. Whereas if there's something fraudulent on your credit card, then you can generally just kind of make a phone call and get that money back or get that charge erased. And another thing that might be an issue is that you end up losing out on some of those rewards that credit cards can bring you. And when you are working towards a goal, that one or 2% cash back, for example, on a credit card can be a significant thing. It may not sound like much, but over the course of a year, it's real money. We wanna thank you very much, Matt. Thank you, Angie, we'll talk to you soon. Go to businessfirstam.com for where to see our show on TV.